What do you say to voters who have concerns about your capabilities to serve? Well, I took two tests, cognitive tests. I aced them, both of them, as you know. We made it public. He took none. I'd like to see him take one, just one, a real easy one. Like, go through the first five questions, he couldn't do it. But I took two cognitive tests. I took physical exams every year. And, you know, we knock on wood wherever we may have wood that I'm in very good health. I just won two club championships, not even senior, two regular club championships. To do that, you have to be quite smart and you have to be able to hit the ball a long way. And I do it. He doesn't do it. He can't hit a ball 50 yards. He challenged me to a golf match. He can't hit a ball 50 yards. Uh, I think I'm in very good shape. I feel that I'm as in good a shape as I was 25, 30 years ago. Actually, I'm probably a little bit lighter, but I'm in as good a shape as I was uh, years ago. I feel very good. I feel the same. But I took, I was willing to take a cognitive test. And you know what, if I didn't do well, I aced him. We'd be able to right wipe out his debt. We'd be able to help make sure that all those things we need to do, child care, elder care, making sure that we continue to strengthen our health care system, making sure that we're able to make every single solitary person eligible for what I've been able to do with the, uh, with, with, with the COVID excuse me, with um, dealing with everything we have to do with, uh, look, if we finally beat Medicare. Thank you, President uh, Biden. Did do a damn thing, and these people should be in jail, and they should be in ones that are being held accountable. And he wants to let them all out, and now he says if he loses again, such a whiner that he is, that it could be a bloodbath. He doesn't care about our veterans. He doesn't care. He doesn't like the military at all. Every single thing he said is a lie. I was recently in, in, in uh, France for D-Day, and I spoke to all about those heroes that died. I went to the World War II cemetery, World War I cemetery he refused to go to. He was standing with his four-star general. And he told me, he said, I don't want to go in there because they're a bunch of losers and suckers. My son was not a loser, he was not a sucker. You're the sucker. You're the loser. I didn't have sex with a porn star. 